class, Mr. H. And you, Macation. Wait, what? How do you even spell that? E, D, J? Eh, forget it. Who knows? As John Dewey once said, education is not preparation for life. Education is life itself. No one wants to be the one who fell behind in education. No one wants to be that guy or gal that just didn't further their education because they were simply lazy. And no one wants to be the one that was passed up for their dream job just because they didn't feel like going to college. On average, those of a higher education make about $40,000 more a year versus just a standard high school diploma. More money in your wallet sounds great, right? I know having a little more money could help me live a little more comfortably. Having a degree of higher education is something a lot of people have just blown off and said, eh, you know what, I think I could do better off without it. Knowing that and always hearing that has always made me think to what my Angela once said. My mother said I must always be ignorant, intolerant of ignorance, but understanding of illiteracy. That some people unable to go to school were more educated and more intelligent than college professors. Well, that has only worked out for a few people, such as Abraham Lincoln, our nation's 16th president, Mr. Walt Disney, the founder of the famous Walt Disney Company, and Mr. Dave Thomas, billionaire, founder of Wendy's Food Chain. Nowadays, a higher education is key to the American dream. You will not be able to just get out and get by like these last few that I mentioned. Going to college, you know, also has other benefits more than just money. College can help with sharpening your communication skills. It can also help with expanding your knowledge and it helps with keeping you organized. College, well, it's a whole new world of learning. Another benefit of going to college is the experience. You also get the opportunity to connect with other people and their problems, other people and their cultures, and even their beliefs. Connecting with people in college opens up doors to improving your networking skills. They could possibly be a reference in the near future on a job application or I mean, even that hookup at a job. Get an associate's, a bachelor's, a master's, or heck, even a doctor's degree. Could be all. Could be all. You need to land your dream job. Having. Having the opportunity to attend school, helps you gather more resources and gather the right questions to ask. For example. If you know, you know, in the future you would like to be a teacher or help kids, then a few classes on child development and child behavior would be a great start. No matter what it is you dream of doing, more than likely there is a college or a class out there that is a great way to get started. Having a higher education is the start of a base to your chosen career. With all the technology we have in this present day, there is more than one way of going to college. We all have seen the commercials that talk about going to school in your own pajamas, sitting at home. That is, that is quite possible if you have a busy schedule. Online colleges may be the answer to your problems. If you are more of a kinesthetic learner, then the classroom environment is more of your style and hands-on learning at the traditional colleges for you. Education has been made accessible to just about everyone in any situation. If money is a problem, then there are solutions for that too. You could apply for a federal grant or FAFSA. Scholarships, tuition assistance, and other student loans or just other ways to get money to go to college. Everybody has heard this at least once in their life. Where there is a will, there is a way. If there is a chance in a million 
that you can do something, anything to keep you what you want from doing in the end, do it. Pry that door open, or if need be, wedge your foot in the door and keep it open. That quote came from wise Pauline Keel. Further your education, there is nothing stopping you. Possibilities are endless. Are there any questions or comments? Back to you, Mr. H.